Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Mrs. Stefan here. So we're going to be working on our hundreds, tens, and ones. All right. So I know that a lot of you have probably seen these little ones before. They are called ones because they are worth one. So here I have one, two. Easy, right? These are called tens rods. All right. They are worth ten each because if you look super closely, I'm going to zoom in there. There are ten of these in each rod. So there are 10 ones in a tens rod. See how they line up? So how many are inside of a tens rod? Say it out loud. Oh, don't shout. Say it out loud though. There are 10 in each tens rod. Okay, so we're going to zoom back out. So here I have three tens. Also, the value is 10, 20, and 30. Okay? All right, so right now I would have 10, 20, 30. 31, 32. Three tens, two ones. All right, now over here, oh, I'm not sure you saw these last year, but I know that you saw them in my last video. These are hundreds. They are called hundreds flats, okay? Why do you think they're called a hundreds flat? Answer that question in your head for a second. Why in the world do you think this thing right here, this one, is called a hundreds flat? Well, I'm going to tell you, it's a hundreds flat because there are 100 cubes or blocks in the hundreds flat. So it's hard to see that. I'm going to zoom in over here. So look at what I did. I went ahead. There are 10 tens rods in a hundreds flat or 100 ones. It's worth 100. Okay? So, and if you look super close, you can see, and if you were to count, there's 10 in each column, okay, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. There are 100 ones in there, or 10 tens, okay? Let's zoom back out. So now that we know that, these are our hundreds, these are our tens, and these are our ones. The value of these is 100, the value of these is 10, and the value of these is 1. So now we're going to take a look at our work for today. First thing you need to do is put your name. On this side, there's only one problem, okay? The first thing you're going to do after you write your name is you're going to cut your box with two columns. We're going to label our first column 100, second column 10, and our third column with a 1. Okay, I'm going to zoom in a little bit so you guys can see. This is all one problem, all right? You're going to count how many hundreds flats are there. Don't tell me how much it's worth. How many flats are there? How many of these do you see? And you're going to write it in the hundreds place. Okay? Then you're going to ask yourself, how many tens do I see? And you'll write it in the tens place. And finally, you'll ask yourself, how many ones do I see? You'll count them and you'll write it here in the ones place. You'll have a single number, okay? This number is the same as the model, okay? This is Crosby, or Flip Mrs. over your paper. The building, please call the office. All right, well, this side gets a little tricky. So they want you to tell me the value of the number. Three tens is the same as what? Well, the first thing I'm gonna do is draw three tens. Remember, tens look like this. So if I draw three tens, one, two, three, well, how much is each ten worth? Ten, twenty, thirty. So I would circle thirty. Okay? Here it says seven tens. So what's the first thing you're going to do? You're going to draw seven tens rods. How do I do that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So now I drew seven of these tens rods, and how much are they each worth? They're each worth 10, so we're gonna skip count by tens. 10, 20, 30. Well, this one says seven. So, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Okay? All right. Now, I'm gonna grade this one. So you're gonna do this one on your own. Draw them, count them. I'm checking that one. Okay? 
All right, now this one gets tricky because we are not going to draw 50 tens. That would take forever, okay? But we know that 10 of these fills 100, okay? So if 10 of them fills 100, 20 of them would fill 200. You got it. 30 of them would fill, say it out loud, 300. 40 of them would fill 400, and 50 of them would fill 500. That's a lot, okay? All right. Now, what if I have 200? Everybody draw me 200s flats. There's 200s flats. And we said there's how many tens in each one? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten in this one. There must be how many in this one? Ten. You got it. And ten plus ten is twenty tens. Well, if two hundred is the same as twenty tens, six hundred should be the same as what? Well, we have six hundreds flats. I couldn't fit all six in there. So there's my six hundreds flats. And each one is worth how much? Ten. Right? So this is ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. Sixty tens. All right? So now that you know that two hundred is the same as twenty tens and six hundred is the same as sixty tens, these two, you are on your own. So I will be checking this one, this one, and that one. Make sure your name is on it and turn it into the homework basket again. Okay? If you are completed with both videos and both pages, great job. Give yourself a pat on the back. Way to go. Have a good day, guys. Later.